vampire bats share their food by vomiting blood for each other. Researchers think they might also call their companions to feed with them. Hunting in vampire bats is something that we just don't really know anything about. And almost nobody can really watch vampire bats going out and foraging. Jerry Carter is an assistant professor at Ohio State University. He's been studying cooperation of vampire bats for about 10 years. So these are bats that drink nothing but blood and they often feed on livestock and they'll fly to a horse or a cow and they make a tiny little bite, sometimes near the foot or sometimes they'll just land on the back of a cow and bite somewhere on the back. And then they lick the wound. They take about a tablespoon of blood, the bats that roosted together and shared food and groomed were also more likely to encounter each other when they were out foraging. Vampire bats vomit blood for other vampire bats to eat as a way to provide their companions and relatives with food when the other has an unsuccessful hunting trip. It's something that all female bats do for their offspring while their offspring is developing. They regurgitate the blood that they've ingested to feed to their offspring. But this has essentially been co-opted, we think, over evolutionary time that adults will also do this for other adults that have failed to feed and not just individuals that they're related to, but even completely unrelated individuals. In Columbus, this is Cynthia Razzi on NBC4i.com.